People with autism can have problems communicating and reading can also be difficult for those who have the disorder. Spe uh, specially formatted documents can help, but how exactly should they look? Well, a research student in Wolverhampton has come up with a solution using cutting-edge eye-tracking software to analyse exactly how people who have autism process what they read. Callum Watkinson explains. Reading is one of the many things that can be a challenge for those living with autism. In the same way that facial cues and body language can be misunderstood, words on a page can too. I find it hard to understand people's faces and voices and bodies, really. Um, so as a result, that makes me very um, sort of socially um, isolated. The challenges I face when it comes to reading is um, understanding the grammar and the syntax um, and the English language itself really, so um, understanding what words mean or what they might mean in a particular context. Documents can be formatted to make them easy to read, but how do those doing the formatting really know what's easy? It's a question that has preoccupied one PhD student at the University of Wolverhampton and her answer is specially designed eye tracking software. We investigated how people with autism read and what exactly is difficult for them in a text with the help of eye tracking techniques which follow their eyes and tell us what exactly they're looking at for how long and what's difficult for them. So we used this data to develop an automatic tool that helps experts developing easy to read content to develop it faster and in a cost effective way and most importantly, it helps them evaluate their output to make sure it really satisfies the requirements of the end users with autism. Dozens of people with autism have participated in Victoria's research and there are many potential applications, <laughs> not least in the classroom and exam hall, where difficulty reading can cause people with autism to give up on education before they otherwise would. Some people with autism are excellent readers, they will excel in education, um, but others um, will drop out of education earlier because they do find texts more difficult to understand. So there is some research looking at um, texts which are set in GCSE exams that show that the way that the texts are presented and the way that the questions are asked um, can make it more difficult for a person with autism to pass those exams. Also the closer you are, the autism affects 700,000 people in the UK directly and millions of their family members by association. This research brings hope of a slightly easier life for all of them. Callum Watkinson, ITV News.